FA Level 1 Diamonds Shooting Game Start of the Session Organise the area and the players as outlined in the graphic. To start the session, the ball is thrown from the spare goalkeeper to a fielder on the outside of the area. The fielder should move to receive the ball. As the ball is travelling, the strikers should look to react to receive the ball from the fielder. Encourage the strikers to show a positive attitude to shoot quickly and accurately. The second striker should follow up for any rebounds. As the ball goes through to the fielders on the opposite side, the strikers should again react and the goalkeeper turns to face the shot. Encourage the strikers to communicate and combine with good movement. Again, encourage accurate shooting and follow up for rebounds. As the ball goes through to the opposite side, the fielders move to field the ball. The strikers react and move to find space to receive the ball from the fielder and the goalkeeper reacts and faces the shot from a new direction. The pattern of the practice is repeated. The fielders field the ball, the strikers react to receive, the goalkeeper spins to face the new shot. Encourage the players to be accurate with their passing with quick, well-timed movement and accurate finishing following up for rebounds. It is important that the fielders on the opposite side move to field the ball. The competition is the first team to score five goals from behind the shooting line. Rebounds count. If the ball goes out of play, the spare goalkeeper picks up a ball and throws the ball to the fielders. The pattern of the practice is then repeated. FA Level 1 Diamonds Shooting Game Progression 1 The ball is distributed from the goalkeeper to a fielder. The fielders either side react and support the ball with a good angle and distance. The ball is set to a supporting fielder. The two strikers react to find space and receive a pass from the fielder. The first challenge is for one of the strikers to finish with a first time shot. Rebounds count. Again, the fielders react to support the player receiving the ball. The strikers move to find space to receive a pass. This time the challenge is for one of the strikers to receive the ball, to turn with the ball and to finish accurately. The fielders must be on the move to field the ball. The ball is set from the receiving fielder to a supporting fielder. The strikers react to create space. This time the second challenge is for one of the strikers to drive down the line and pull the ball back for the second striker to time their run and finish from the pull back pass with a first time shot. Follow up for rebounds. The opposite fielders again react and set the ball back to a supporting fielder. The third challenge is for the strikers to pass a through ball 
for the second striker to run onto and to finish accurately with a first time shot. The pattern is repeated. The ball is set to a supporting fielder. The strikers react. This time the strikers combine quickly with a given goal for a first time shot. Encourage the second striker to follow up for rebounds. The challenge is the first team to score with all five challenges. Rebounds count. FA Level 1 Diamonds Shooting Game Progression 2 All the players are to be numbered and the players should remember their numbers. The ball is distributed to a fielder outside of the shooting area. The other fielding players to support the player receiving the ball. The ball is passed to one of the supporting players. The two forwards in the shooting area react to find space to receive the ball. One of the fielders from the outside makes a run to join the strikers. The three players combine one touch with good communication and one of the players looks to shoot first time. Follow up for rebounds of the goalkeeper. After shooting, the yellow team and goalkeeper reorganise. The opposite team filled the shot, set the ball back to a supporting fielding player. The two forwards create space and they combine one touch again with all the players touching the ball and one of them finishing with a first time shot. Again, players should follow up for rebounds. The white team and goalkeeper now reorganise with only two strikers in the shooting area. The pattern of the practice is repeated. One of the fielders should always make a run to join the two strikers in the shooting area. The players look to combine first time passing and end up with a first time shot. The objective of the competition is for all the players in both teams to score a goal. The condition is that the players must combine with first time passing. All players must touch the ball and the shot must be a first time finish. FA Level 1 Diamonds Shooting Game Progression 3 In this progression introduce a defender to create a 2v1 situation. The defenders start on the shooting line and the fielders are positioned outside of the shooting area. The goalkeeper distributes the ball to a fielder. The fielders must be on the move to receive the ball. As soon as the fielder has received the ball, the defender can now defend and the strikers move to find space. The ball is passed to a striker. The strikers should look to be positive and take shooting opportunities if they're the best decisions. The second striker should move to support the first striker. Encourage players to be positive and play with their heads up and make the right decisions. 
Encourage players to have accurate shots and follow up for rebounds. After the shot, the strikers rotate with the fielders and the goalkeeper faces a new direction. The practice is repeated, the defender defending and the strikers combining with clever play to create shooting opportunities. Encourage accurate shooting and follow up for rebounds. As soon as the shot has been hit, the yellow player swap rolls and the goalkeeper faces the new attack. Repeat the practice. Encourage the strikers to be positive, play with their heads up and make the correct decisions. Communication between the two strikers will really help them. This is a fast moving practice and players will have to be on their toes and alert to understand their roles and what they're doing. Encourage quick, clever combination play, one touch between the strikers if possible. Once the players understand the practice, make it a competition with the winning team the first to score four or six goals. If a defender wins the ball, one goal is deducted from the score.